Tomorrow will be Haley's probably the biggest day of her life, yet she has trepidation. Not about Dalton at all. I mean, she's calm, cool, collected. They're soulmates. We know that. It's about her dad speaking tonight. I only want the best for you. That's true. Make no mistake. When people come up and ask, you know, aren't you guys nervous? Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, no, we're not nervous. I mean, it's 100% right, and we know that it's right. I've seen them interact, even though they know I'm not watching, I am. And I just think they're, they're soulmates. And here, undoubtedly, it's right. Marriage elevates your relationship to the highest possible level. And, hey, I just wanted to say that my entire family is truly blessed to have you, and Dalton more than anyone. They say that you're supposed to marry your best friends. You're getting the most loyal, caring, and compassionate girl I mean, I've ever met in my life. I can't attest to the love that they have. It has been truly a blessing. I cannot thank you enough for joining this family and being there always for Dalton. And I know that you always will be. And enjoy the people that are here tonight and that'll be here with us all this weekend because they're the ones that you'll never forget. Same people that really have lifted you guys up, you know, and really been the uh, foundation of what you guys are all about, you know, family, friends, and so that's contagious to be around. <laughs> He's the perfect spouse for Haley with a family that I absolutely adore. He's handsome, athletic, and educated, and is smitten for Haley, that's for sure. Haley, you are an incredible person, and I've loved getting to know you over the years, and I truly value our friendship. You really do bring out the best in Dalton. And I'm just so glad you put up with them for all these years. I really want to say thank you because we couldn't have done it without you. We have people come from all over and it just, we appreciate it so, so much. To be in Pensacola on New Year's in the rain, <laughs> it's, uh, Welcome family and friend. We're here today to celebrate the love and commitment Dalton and Haley share for each other and to be witness to their marriage. What if we're living in a fantasy? Some world that I could only dream. New colors bursting out of every scene. A hidden land for you and me Imagination is the only rule Mystery the only school The flowers talk and trees can walk around Sometimes our feet float off the ground
Ms. Dalton, I'm so proud of you for the man that you've become. I'm even more proud of you for marrying this beautiful woman right next to you, Haley. Let's let's all give a round of applause for Haley. Take my Dalton, will you take Haley to be your wife? I will. Will you love her and comfort her, honor and keep her, in sickness and in health, forsaking all others as long as you both shall live? I will. Haley, will you take Dalton to be your husband? I will. <laughs> <laughs> Love and comfort him, honor and keep him, in sickness and in health, forsaking all others as long as you both shall live. I will. Haley. You're my truest friend, my constant supporter, and now my beautiful bride. On this day, I give you my heart and my promise that I will forever be by your side to walk with you, to hold your hand, and to comfort you wherever this journey leads us. Dalton, I cannot believe this day is here. Today, I choose you to be my husband and my life partner. I promise you my unconditional love and to always love you for who you are. I will encourage you, encourage your dreams, and respect you always. In the mountains, and on the beaches, from sunrise to sunset. I love your sense of adventure and travel and your eagerness to try new things. I promise to support your dreams and aspirations and encourage you to do your best in all that you do. I promise to never stop enjoying this beautiful life with you. I will listen closely and hold you closer through sorrow and through success. I vow to believe in you and celebrate your greatest triumphs. I vow to be giving and forgiving and always put your needs before my own. I promise I will work hard, not only to provide for our family, but to work hard at our marriage and this love we share between us. Today, surrounded by the ones we love, I vow to honor you, to be faithful to you, to celebrate you, and to always make our family's love and happiness my priority. And I promise to be your biggest supporter and your most proud supporter as you grow into the world's most beautiful mother. This is my solemn vow to you in sickness and in health for all the days of my life. My Dougie, I love you and fall more in love with you with every day. You are my best friend, my love, and my life. 
you are my person. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Dalton Allen. I can see through all the faces telling me to find my place and I'm so close that I can taste it. So please raise your glasses, flip on your dancing shoes, shake a leg, indulge in food, and enjoy unlimited booze. I am truly blessed to welcome you into our family. I love you both so much, so, so much. what the future holds. Um, again, let's raise our glasses and cheers to the future Allens. Y'all are incredible. And we're, we're so excited to see uh, what the future holds. A toast to my daughters, Haley and Kyle. <laughs> I look at all these occasions as mitzvahs. This is a great mitzvah. And I want to wish them, first of all, mazel tov, good luck, and l'chaim to life. Have a happy life. We love you. Dalton, you may kiss your bride.